Yep. The UC system ran the board. Ran the board, dude. Uh, California, California, baby. California is, is, continues to lead in fundamental research. Yeah. This is our day three mm -hmm. of the last Nobel day. Prize week. So many of you, thousands of you, have joined us for this journey. It's been an incredible week. Yeah. I wanted to do a quick tally. Uh, this is like our ESPN top 10. So on the institution side, we had some some unsurprising yeah. uh, number one winner. So at the top with uh, four Nobels is uh, Berkeley. Yep. Three for physics, one for chemistry. Kyoto at two. Uh, UCSB, unexpectedly for me, two. UCLA, one. Princeton got on the board. We got on the board. We got on the board with one. Yale with one. Uh, Princeton, we're putting before Yale because we came first. Yeah. Um, and then we have uh, University of Il uh, Illinois, Ur Urbana-Champaign with one. Oxford, Melbourne, Cambridge, and Paris Sud University, all with a single Nobel. Yeah. And if we look at it by country, number one, mm -hmm. big old America. USA, baby. Six universities in the U.S., uh, two from the U.K., mm -hmm. one from Japan, one from France. And one from Australia. Yeah. So great representation. Yep. Yep. The UC system ran, ran the board. Ran the board, dude. Uh, California, California, baby. California is, is, continues to lead in sort of fundamental research. Yeah. Um, and this was the public institutions in California. Right. Right. right? Not, not the yeah. private. I guess Stanford and Caltech didn't, di didn't show up this year. Maybe maybe next year, guys. Yeah. Maybe Neither next year. Neither did MIT or Harvard. <laughs> but Princeton's there. Princeton's there. <laughs> oh, goodness.